Hey guys, it's Vox here with another video, and welcome back to Shadow of the Colossus. In the last episode, I raged quite a bit because we were fighting the Honeydew Colossus, as I call it. And this episode, I don't know if it's going to be as much rage, but definitely as much frustration. Um, the problem with this is... This next Colossus, I always have trouble finding the Colossus. Now, for my practice run, I actually journeyed to this Colossus three times in order to try to learn how to get there. Hopefully that was enough so that I'm comfortable with um, actually getting to the Colossus, but we'll see because I always have trouble with it. In fact, this is actually the second time recording this episode because the first time I just got lost and my commentary was terrible. So, anyway... I don't know what just happened there, but let's just continue on. So, this next Colossus, not only is the journey to it difficult, it has always given me trouble. Um, it used to be one of the more difficult Colossi, in my opinion. I've gotten a lot better at it now, but this is... Well, I think the last one, really, is when the Colossi start to get, get to be very difficult. Um... Difficult to say the least, of course. I mean, they... Ah, <sighs> difficult. <laughs> okay. Anyway, um, I think I know where I'm going. It should be this way. See, I was just going here by instinct because I've done it so many times now. But watch, I'm still going to get lost. Yeah. Um, like now, how... I... Hold on. Going the wrong way, how great. I'm supposed to go by where Gaius was, that's right. I knew that. I don't know what I'm doing. Alright, let's turn around. This would be an epic thumbnail. Just this right here. Look at that. I, I know I've said that so many times, but just pause this and it's still it's like an awesome picture. <sighs> anyway. So we actually want to head to the area where Gaius is. Um, it's called Canopy Lake. And we can pass that lake, and um, we'll get to where we want to be. By the way, Gaius was the third Colossus, if you don't remember. So this is the way we should be going. Alright, and here we are at Canby Lake. So we just want to come over here and kind of go around the perimeter of the lake. Oh, okay, don't do that. Well then. Um, Alright, there you go, aggro. My little derp horse. Alright, and then we come over here. It's very foggy, isn't it? Alright, so, now, do we go right or do we go left? Um, I think, yeah, I'm pretty sure we go right here. I'm pretty sure. And then here, we also go right? Um, I'm not sure. And then here we go right again. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. So we go right in all three passages. That's what it is. Why didn't I just mark it like that before? I mean, oh well. Anyway, that's what you want to do. And then you come here, which is all good. And um, there's a way shrine over there. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up the lizard from there, because why not? We do want to increase our stamina a bit. Yes, we all know what happens when we don't have enough stamina. We last episode kind of defined that, didn't it? All right. Yeah. See, over there is where we're going to be going. All right. Let's see if we can find this lizard. There it is. All right. Please don't run away. Just let me. Okay. Don't. Don't get up. Don't get up. Don't. 
Ah, <sighs> where are you? Where'd he go? Oh, there it is. Now it's up there. I won't be able to get it if it's up there. Unless I climb up there, but... It's anno really annoying how you can't kill the lizards. You have to shoot them down and then run to them. Like, within just a couple of seconds. And now I have no... It's probably on the other side. There it is. There we go. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. What do you What? Why did why couldn't I grab it? What? Oh. Stop moving. Just fall down already. I'm not gonna make it up in time, am I? No, I'm not. Why don't you just stay down dead for just a little bit longer? So that way I can come up to you. By the way, I am gonna start cutting these parts out, I think. Is this I don't want this to happen in every episode yet. I also I do want to gain my stamina or to increase my stamina, so I probably will be cutting these out from now on, but this is the last one. And it's a wonderful one, isn't it? God, where are you? There's so much trouble for such a little thing. You're so fast. Why you be so fast? Okay, there it is. I don't know, but it's a bad spot. Because that's it's just gonna fall there, and I'm gonna have to climb up, and it won't work. Okay. Go, like, here, so I can shoot you. Oh, now it stands still. Oh. Okay, well, that worked. Anyway, let's just... Let's just go. Let's just forget that happened. Whatever, I got my increase in stamina for the episode. And let's not... This derp horse, it either goes... It either makes me walk to him or it just goes too far and still makes me walk to him. Oh well, we're not going to be using him for this fight. Luckily. Alright, you stay here. Or you can go ahead, whichever way. I'm not taking you with me, though. You're staying right here. Don't go anywhere. Please don't go anywhere. I know you like to go places, just don't. Alright, so... First thing you want to do here is just pretty much go down. You can climb this tower if you want, but it's pretty much pointless. Because you want to come over to that fallen bridge here. That is Hydrus. Yeah, alright. First thing you want to do is you want to try to aggravate him. Now, since he is underwater, it's not like he can shoot arrows or anything. So, the best way I find to do it is just by swimming above him. And pay attention to where his head is. Because, 
Well, you'll see in a second. By the way, those things that look like electricity are actually electricity, and they will hurt you later on if you're not careful, so just be cautious of those at all times. Alright, and if we can try to... You want to try to get above where his head is, because that's what's going to make him see you. Here we go. So as you can see, it looks like his head is kind of surfacing a bit. That's a good sign. You want to try to stay above him and hold down R1. Just trust me. Hold down R1. Ignoring those things. Hold down R1. Hold down R1. And you'll grab onto his tail, which will surface above water just for a tiny bit, which is why you want to hold it down. That way you make sure to do it. So now we're underwater. He's going to try to get you off by kind of yanking his body up out of the water a bit. So once you're out of the water, just run as much as you can. Okay, that was close. And then grab on. And I'm off balance, so that doesn't really help. Okay. Let's try this again. And no, you cannot crawl underwater, so you just have to hold on. And the only time you can actually move is when you're above water, like this. I wow, I am losing balance really quickly. I don't I don't usually do that. What is, what's going on? No. Already I'm having bad luck on this. Great. Alright, and you want to try to stab him. You just need a small stab. There's that, I don't know if you were able to see it, but there was a minor sigil right in front of that electric thing. And just stabbing it once is going to permanently... Um, ouch. Yes, that hurts you if you don't do it in time. Um, it's going to permanently deactivate or destroy whatever the term... Why is that not... Okay, I'm a bit in front of it. And that's going to hurt me. Yes, that does do damage, by the way. If you look down at my health, you can see that. There we go. And those do do some somewhat major damage. Alright, anyway, once the music goes back to peaceful like that, go ahead and let go because it's going to try to drown you. And he will successfully drown you if you keep holding on because that means he's just going to be going further and further underwater. So... That means that the cycle is over, so pay attention to the music. Once you do that, you just want to do the exact same thing by um, just going by above his head and having him surface up. Now, those electric things will stay um, unworking. I don't know what the word is. <laughs> they, they won't turn back on, so you've permanently destroyed those. So that's good. So you, now we only have one to worry about. I think I aggravated him. I'm not sure. I don't. No, I don't think I did. He's too far underwater. All right, let's try this again. All right, now he sees me. When you hear that noise, that's another sign of him seeing you. There we go. Once again, hold down R1. go. Now, normally holding down R1 without anything to grab on will just dive you underwater, and it's going to do that. Don't worry about it. You'll still um, automatically grab on once the fur gets into your reach. Alright, so same process, except this time we really don't have those electric things to worry about, except for that one over there by his head. And if I would stop falling like that, why is it doing that? Like, my fr my practice run through this, I got up to his head and did some damage on the Major Sigil before he even submerged, um, like, before it went back to the peaceful music. And I didn't stumble like that at all, so I don't know what's going on. It's just a Let's Play curse, that's what it is. You always do worse when you're recording. No! Okay. 
Alright, this is a bad position to be in because he's a bit angled off. Alright. Please don't submerge too soon. I really want to at least get to his head once. No! Don't fall off either. That would be bad. Ouch! That should've done it! Why did that do it? Ow! <laughs> there we go. Alright, now there's the major sigil right there. We can get a couple of good stabs on this, hopefully. Ah, dang it. That was close. Watch out for when he's about to stick his head underwater, because he can't stab there, so you really need to time this right. Alright, one more shot. Wow, look at his health! Just even like a tiny shot's gonna do it. So let's do a tiny shot. What? That wasn't tiny enough! Okay. Apparently it's to be bigger than the tiny shot. Yes, this Colossus is smart. He's gonna be doing that diving, trying to yank you off. And it will work if you're not careful, like me. Alright, now I'm right above the Major Sigil. Of course it goes back to the peaceful music, right when I'm on the Major Sigil, when he has like one HP left. Ugh. Alright, one last time, let's do this. Again, these colossi get more and more difficult, and I'm scared of the next one. Because I did really well on the next one in my practice run, but I also did well on this one. So, that just tells you, yeah, you really don't do how you do in your practice run. It's just... Okay, and he's real... Why is he going so far away? He's like way over there. I think. Yeah. It's a bit more difficult when he loses his electric things. Um... Oh. Wait. Where is he? What? What's the button that shows you where he is? I just heard his... No oh! He's right under me. <laughs> okay. Um, hi there. Alright. Alright, alright. Maybe can I get, like, somewhat close down? Whatever. I'll just hold down button. There we go. Alright, third time we can do this. What's he doing? Um. Well then. Okay, someone's a bit angry. There we go. Now we're good. Kind of. At least I'm not stumbling like I was before. I don't know what that was all about. No, don't fall off. Please don't fall off. That would be very bad. Very bad indeed. Don't fall off! Wander! Wander! <laughs> Alright. No, don't do that! No! <laughs> Stay! Just, just stop! Why? Ah! I don't like this at all. 
I don't like this. No! I forgot it does that. And I'm not, it's like, I'll be careful about him doing this. Because he's one smart colossus. Alright, I just need to get up to there for once. With just one small stab. One small stab. Not small and. Oh, uh, we're not big enough, whatever. It was small enough, it was too small. Just one stab. Stab. Finally! Yes! Well, there goes Hydrus. Goodbye. Not gonna miss you. And now the blue lightning is gonna come from underwater, so I'm a bit freaked out. I don't know where it is. It's just gonna surprise me, isn't it? Maybe. I don't even know. There's my jumping water non-realistic physics. Where's the lightning? Oh god, there it is. Alright. Hey there. 